many students use the bus to go to and from school, although one student is looking to expand it into something more. Lewis Cox owns a 64 passenger school bus, one he plans on transforming into a miniature home. I was really drawn to the um, ecological living of tiny living, living within one's means, having only uh, what we need, um, not just what we want. Sort of a proposed solution to um, the affordable housing crisis. I think it's great. I, I helped uh, find the bus and I, I have an interest in smaller homes as well and minimalism. I'm very curious to see the creativity of building the bus. Welcome aboard. We have a kitchenette over here, a refrigerator, some storage, uh, air conditioning unit, two captain's chairs, and a bed. A major influence for Lewis's decision was the Call of Service May term course taught by Simpson Religion professor Jan Everhart. Lewis told me before we went to Denver last year that he was really interested in this tiny house movement. I think Lewis was just really inspired by all of that. For him to be exploring it at this age, I think it's wonderful. And Lewis seems pretty excited too. It's just a fun story, right? Like it's a fun um, project to be taking on and there's a lot of sort of whimsy wrapped up in the whole thing. Lewis plans to live out of the bus during graduate school. However, these acts of environmental consciousness is something with which we can all hop on board. For The Simpsonian, I'm Noah Sacco.